What's up, YouTube family? Today, chess day. I'm Brett. This is Daniel. Nice to meet He's you. got his sunglasses ready, as you can see. We're both aiming to work up to a heavy triple. Uh, five sets of three at 175. Um, we'll keep you with us, followed by a few accessory movements. Stay tuned. Get ready for it. How's it going, YouTube family? Flex Brothers Fitness, video number one. So glad you could tune in. Um, first of many. So today, push day, we were working up to five sets of heavy triples at 80% um, flat bench. This is, I'd say 90% of the time, this is my first movement. Um, I really do find that low volume training um, on the bench press, I've found has really helped develop um, mass throughout this caloric surplus and overall in the past two years in particular, um, since I've really started placing an emphasis on it. Our second, second exercise was flat dumbbell bench, just to throw in some extra volume. Um, four sets of 12 to 15 reps, that hairline dough. Um, so yeah, this was just to add some extra volume, slow-mo effects, for real. Um, our third exercise was something we don't usually do, uh, the standing pec press using a barbell, usually the T-bar. Um, this places huge emphasis on the middle pectoral muscle. Um, not that there's really a muscle there, but... It really helps chisel out that cavern in the middle of your pecs. Um, rocking that Alpha Elite shirt from Christian Guzman, by the way. Awesome, awesome quality. Y'all make sure you go ahead and get one, support your boy. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a great exercise in the sense that um, it is good to really chisel out that middle pectoral. Um, at the same time, you have to, I like to do lighter weight just to really focus on the contraction. Uh, really try to avoid ego lifting with that lift. Um, so this is, we have the incline pec flies. Uh, we actually use the bench with this and instead of just traditionally standing up. Um, I find that a lot of the time it allows me to um, really focus on getting the top, that top chest uh, contracting a lot more as opposed to the traditional pec fly. Oh man, those facial genetics, you gotta love them, eh? <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is, uh, moving on to triceps. We had overhead extensions, you know, self-explanatory, uh, really like doing some really high volume on here. As you can see, it's quite a, quite a long set. I think I went for about 20 to 25 reps here, um, to be exact. Um, and our second last tricep, uh, movement were tricep pull down, just traditional, you know, nothing fancy. And as you can see, I am using cheat reps towards the end here. Guys, don't be afraid to do so. It's good to push past failure with cheat reps. And that's all she wrote. Thank you guys for watching. See you again. Chest, triceps, push day, complete. First video, complete. Daniel, what's on the menu? I'm gonna go home, eat the rest of my KFC, <laughs> some french fries, some chicken legs. Gotta get that protein somehow, right? It's bulking season. Seriously. But uh, yeah, first video, you know, tell us what you like, tell us what we can add. Um, it's only on the rise from here. We appreciate you and uh, make sure you comment, subscribe, like, subscribe, holla back at your boy. No, I'm just joking. But uh, hit the like button, follow, and uh, we promise to entertain you. Peace out, guys. The feels when the fridge is full of leftovers and all you want to do is make gains. Fork.